I'm Dr. Roger, and this question is from the May 2021 USSAT non-calculator. College Board is asking about this exponential equation, in particular the interpretation of 1.11 in context. Choice A says the model predicts there are approximately 1.11 flower beetles in this area on June 1st. June 1st is t equals zero days after June 1st, but b of zero equals 100 times 1.11 to the zero equals 100, which is not 1.11, so choice A is not correct. Choice B, model predicts the number of flower beetles increases by approximately 1.11 each day. Let's see what happens at one day. B of one equals 100 times 1.11 to the first equals 100 times 1.11 is 111. That's an increase of 11 beetles, not 1.11 beetles. So choice B is not correct. Choice C, model predicts it will take approximately 1.11 days for the number to double. B of two is 100 times 1.11 squared is 100 times 1.11 times 1.11 again, which is 111 times 1.11 1 .11 is 111, 111, 1, 1, which is certainly nowhere near doubling, so choice C is not correct. Choice D, model predicts the number of flower beetles grows by a factor of approximately 1.11 each day. From day 0 to day 1, we multiply by 1.11. From day 1 to day 2, we also multiply by 1.11. So choice D is the correct interpretation of the base for this exponential function. College Board will often ask you to interpret constants and coefficients from a function, and in particular, they'll often ask about exponentials. It's important to know that the base of the exponential is the quantity that your value is multiplied by each time the exponent increases by one. Come back soon for my next video. With math, there's always more.